Yoo -hoo. It's the time for Package from China. Hey guys, welcome back to the channel. It's awesome that you're tuning in because we're going to take a close look at something cool. Yeah. We're going to take a close look at the best controller, I think, is my personal opinion, the best casual controller for the Super Console X. And it doesn't really matter if you're having the normal, the pro, or the stick. It's all the same in the end. But which controller is so good? Stay tuned and let's find out. I just want to point out that there are a lot of different controllers on AliExpress. I have tried a lot of them and most are pretty damn shitty. But this one basically found me. Yep, seriously, this controller found me. I didn't even order it like I found it and ordered it. And I was so surprised by it. I can say it's the controller surprise of 2021. The people who are familiar to my channel and my videos, I think you will remember this controller. And yep, for the people who didn't know, it came with my Super Console X PC edition. I got this controller and I was completely surprised by it, how good it actually was. Okay, so basically what is this? This is a PlayStation 3 controller. You can use it for PlayStation 3, of course. Duh. And the PC. And when I was looking on AliExpress, I couldn't really find it because it's very hard to find. Somebody in the Wicked family pointed it out, sent me the link through Twitter. And I was very surprised to see it and it is not even very expensive. And therefore, I just want to point out that this controller is, in my opinion, basically one of the best controllers or casual controllers that you can get. It also comes with some cards. They are not really usable here in this area when I'm living. But the reason I was a big fan is the way how it looks. And, of course, how it smells because this thing is not chemical like most of these controllers. So let's take a close look at an overview and I will tell you why I think this thing is so cool. Okay, first of all, it comes with a very long cable. Not with the waving cables that you can see like with more like the premium brands or the game controllers. Just a basic cable, but very long. The layout itself is quite unique. I mentioned in my Super Console X PC review that it looks similar to a PlayStation 4 on some different ways. For example, over here, the handles that you hold feels almost exactly like a PlayStation 4. And I must say that I'm very pleased with it because one of my favorite controls nowadays is still the PlayStation 4. It feels super comfortable. Here at the top, we're going to get four shoulder buttons. The click itself is just your membrane buttons. No fancy trigger buttons. The D-pad itself plays very nice. Nice analog controls. And of course, A, B, X and Y. Select, start or back and start. And we also have a turbo function on this controller. So for schmeps, this is very convenient. So therefore, with all the functionalities in combination, how good it feels. I think this is one of the best casual controllers that you can buy on AliExpress. And not to forget, it's not very expensive. But let's hook it up and configure it with the Super Console X. Okay, so let's untangle this cable nightmare. And let's plug in the device. Okay, I take consideration you always need to shut down your Super Console X before you're going to plug in the cable. So that's what we're going to do. It's shut down. All right, let's plug it in. Let's power it on. And let's go. Okay, since I've booted up, the gamepad has been detected. Let's hold the A button. The fun fact is like it did see the controller, but it noticed it like an Xbox 360 controller. So that's quite unique. Okay, so let's set up the controller. I also did a separate tutorial if you want to have some more or better explanation what you need to do. The D-pad configuration, start select, press A, B, X, Y. We have the L, R, L. T and the RT buttons, so let's configure those. Okay, then hold the button for skipping to the next. Okay, so the first game that I want to test out with the controller is Street of Rage. So what I've noticed with a bad D-pad, that it is very hard to move around with the character itself. I already mentioned the D-pad feels just amazing, and you can see that moving around is no problem whatsoever. The touch itself on the buttons is very nice, and it feels also like just like a really quality controller. But okay, so let's try a fighting game and let's see how good it works with the analog stick and of course the D-pad. Okay, so the next game and D-pad is just a must have in my opinion. It's essential to games like this, so let's try this game. Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles, I love it. I play it very often on my original Mega Drive. But the problem is that the CPU is freaking cheap. 
sadly the analog stick is not reconfigured but you can see that the d-pad is super responsive want to be cheap I'm going to give you the freaking cheesy corner no okay guys so next up let's try the analog stick but the same story applies to the analog stick it works very well it feels like it feels just like a very nice quality joystick. I've played the game so much on my Ed Games arcade machine. A pretty damn basic beat 'em up, but it's so much fun. Slap him with a stick. Slap him with a stick. No, I want to slap you with a stick. Slap you with a pipe. Slap, slap, slap. Talk to my pipe. <coughs> All right, guys, so the reason I picked this controller because it's not very expensive. It's easy to get on AliExpress and I just wanted to have like a good quality controller for not a lot of money because I'm a budget shopper and I love the one it's cheap. So therefore, I just want to give you this, let's say, tip and idea. This is a controller that can be very convenient to play. The D-pad is nice, good analog sticks, it plays very comfortable. And yeah, you can buy it because I got it from my Super Console XPC, but you can buy it in two different colors. I want to thank you for watching, consider subscribing and hit that little bell, become on the Wicked family and let me know what controller are you using and are you interested in this. And I will see you in the next one.